Well, in St. Charles Parish now, residents are complaining about high water bills. Uh, some of you reached out to us wondering what is going on. WDSU reporter Morgan Lentis went straight to the parish president for answers. She's live in Luling with what she has learned. Morgan? Well, so look, Parish President Matt Jewell tells me there are several factors that could be contributing to those higher than normal bills in June. He says that includes this brutal heat as well as a longer than normal billing cycle. If they feel like something's incorrect on the bill, we need them to contact the Waterworks Department. Point blank, Parish President Matt Jewell says that is how to handle a higher than normal water bill because as we all suffer under this intense summer sun, some residents in St. Charles say temperatures aren't the only thing that's soaring. You know, $400 water bill that you weren't expecting that used to be $70 or $80 is crazy. Carol Dazarn lives in Luling and says for the past year, her bill has been steadily increasing, then doubling in June. She worked with the parish to identify a possible leak, but says they didn't find one. Dazarn, like many residents, aired her frustration on Facebook, which she says prompted a robust response from local officials. They sent out another water person because it was showing that I was using 20, 10 to 20 gallons an hour, even at three in the morning, but some hours were zero. So that to me doesn't tell me leak. Meaning Dazarn will have to wait and hope for answers soon. Meantime, some have questioned if new smart meters are to blame. I asked Jewel about that too. 18,000 of our 22,000 customers are already on a smart meter. Um, so it's, it's not anything new. We have replaced about 6,000 meters this year. Uh, so we did have a big batch of them. And with those new meters, we find uh, things like leaks or we find that the old meter was very inaccurate. In addition, he says June was seven days longer than a normal billing cycle. Still, he has ordered a full audit of the parish's billing practices, meter accuracy and more. You know, I feel like in, in the next week or so, we should be able to release something to the public and really give some insight uh, to to what was causing some higher usage. And at next Monday's council meeting, Parish President Matt Jewell says he hopes to have some of that information available for the public. That meeting is happening at 6 p.m. And I'm told water will be on the agenda. Reporting live in Luling tonight, I'm Morgan Lentis, WDSU News. All right, good information there, Morgan. Thank you. St. Charles Parish officials also plan to compare their water usage to a neighboring parish to see what consumption is like regionally for comparison purposes.